Prime Video announced the continuation of the Reacher series not long after the first season became a success for the streaming service. Following Tom Cruise's portrayal of the character, there was a little break before the series brought Lee Child's Jack Reacher back to our screens. The displays are a little bit smaller this time around, though, as Reacher is now a Prime Video TV show. Despite this, now that Alan Richson is playing the lead, Reacher is more popular than ever. The Titans actor, who is closer to the characters imposing 6 feet 5 inches in the books at 6 feet 2 inches, really does make excellent use of that physique in Reacher Season 1. But what about Season 2 of Jack Reacher? What comes after the adaption on Amazon? Here is everything you need to know about Reacher Season 2 on Prime Video. Reacher Season 2 Potential Release Date When will Reacher Season 2 air on Prime Video? As previously mentioned, Reacher was renewed by Prime Video just three days after Season 1 premiered, but a release date has yet to be set in stone. Reacher was among Amazon's top five most watched series ever, both in the US and internationally over a 24-hour period, according to Deadline. It also has a good ranking among users, so this prompt renewal shouldn't be too shocking. We already knew that filming will begin this fall courtesy to a prior update from main guy Richson. And sure enough, in September 2022, he informed fans once more with an Instagram post from the set. In a video, he declared, We're back, larger and better than before. I'm prepared to start off with a Reacher slate. Now that it's been confirmed, we're in. We don't anticipate any new episodes to air until the beginning of 2023, but we're hoping for a summer 2023 premiere. Or perhaps we're overreaching. Reacher Season 2 cast, who is returning for Reacher Season 2. Along with Richson's Reacher, the first season of Reacher featured characters like Harvey Gillen's Jasper, Willa Fitzgerald's Roscoe, and Finley played by Malcolm Goodwin. But considering how the season finale ended, it appears like Alan Richson, who plays Reacher, is the only cast member who can be counted on to show up again. Reacting to Reacher's quick season 2 renewal, Richson shared the following on Instagram. Voila, uh, this is incredible. Unlike Reacher who chooses to say nothing, I'm simply speechless. In just our opening weekend you've made hashtag Reacher and Prime one of it Prime video most watched shows ever. That is insane. I have a lot of people to thank for making this performance so entertaining. But if you weren't engrossed in the Reacher universe, all of the inventive creativity and steadfast dedication of those behind this would be for naught. Please accept my sincere gratitude. Francis Neagley, Reacher's former army subordinate, is one of the few returning characters across novels, as fans of the books are aware. Maria Sten will return for the second installment, it has been announced via deadline. Maxwell Jenkins could return as a younger Reacher in additional flashbacks in the future, but if he ages up too quickly, the production staff might think about replacing him for season 2 if they want to show more of Reacher's upbringing. The young actor undoubtedly hopes to continue appearing in the popular program. Jenkins told pop culturalist that Lee Child has created a wonderful world with his Jack Reacher novels. I believe people are grateful for the beautiful and accurate adaptation done by Nick Santora and the main performers. There is a good reason why people adore these books. The tales are intriguing. The characters are distinctive and enjoyable to travel with. I'm honored to contribute in any way to such a fantastic series, and I hope I can keep expanding on the Reacher saga in any way I can. Willa Fitzgerald, who appeared in season 1 as police officer Roscoe Conklin, will not be coming back, it has been revealed. She said in a July interview with Digital Spy for the UK premiere of the new film 1812 that she was aware from the beginning that it would only be a one-time cameo. Yes, she admitted, I did know it from the beginning. That presents a wonderful chance to present a clear and thorough account and then be free to move on. It's a distinctive TV experience, in my opinion. Later in the interview, she noted, it's wonderful to have the agency know that that is a complete, finished product. Additionally, it was wonderful to launch the entire Reacher universe. However, a number of new names have been revealed ahead of Season 2, suggesting that a total cast reorganization may be in the works. Sarinda Swan has been cast as Carla Dixon, and other actors joining the cast include Rory Cochrane from 24, Dominic Lombardazzi from Boardwalk Empire, Ferdinand Kingsley, Ty Victor Olsen from The Man in the High Castle, Josh Blacker from Sea, and Al Sapienza from Suits, along with Shannon Cook Chun from The 100, Luke Billick from The Good Witch, Andres Colantes from The Honor Society, and Edson Morales from Fahrenheit 451. Dean McKenzie from Arrow has also been included. Showrunner Nick Santora appears to have left room for rumor regarding the possibility that any of the other Season 1 cast members could make a surprise comeback. Santora told TV Line, I will say this, and I'm not trying to be coy or cute, you never know if a character might come back. We can have a brilliant thought and exclaim, you know what? Then you bring them back for a little cameo or for a longer stay, thinking maybe that character may work in Season 2 or Season 3. Having said that, Santora also emphasized a crucial element of the storytelling. Reacher is not a figure who travels with a group of people. You must remember that he is a lone wolf. Reacher Season 2 Plot What will happen in Reacher Season 2? The first season of Reacher focused on Jack's pursuit of the person responsible for his brother's murder, and by the end of the final episode, the investigation was largely complete. 
Even if Roscoe hopes otherwise, Reacher decides to leave Margrave when the mystery is solved in order to pursue new opportunities. She hands Reacher a chocolate wrapper bearing her phone number and says, If you wander back, call me. After saying his farewell, Reacher enters a medal in his brother's grave that holds a lot of sentimental worth. He wipes away his tears and starts to hitchhike to new pastures. The first season of Jack Reacher was based on the first book in the series, Killing Floor. It has now been revealed that the second season will skip to book number 11, Bad Luck and Trouble, for inspiration. The choice to go ahead isn't particularly shocking because showrunner Santora already told TV Line that fans shouldn't necessarily expect them to follow chronologically. Furthermore, Reacher still has 26 novels worth of source material to pull from, so there is still a lot that may be explored in any further future seasons. Child responded as follows when approached by Radio Times previously about the potential next book for adaptation. The books weren't read by me. They're authored by myself. I never read them again. By reputation and what others have said about them, I am familiar with them. Some are also quite well liked. The fact that Reacher's loneliness was alleviated by his relationships with other people, in my opinion, made the first season so fantastic. I would like to see more of that. Two or three books particularly stand out in that regard. Thus, perhaps one of them. Reacher Season 2 trailer. Any Reacher Season 2 footage yet? It's not too far-fetched to speculate that fresh Reacher Season 2 video will surface in the weeks before the release. Therefore, that will probably be in early 2023. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe for more.